AI just got PhD level smart. New reasoning models don't just follow orders, they actually think. Here's what that means for you. A major change has happened in the past couple of weeks, a move from linear generative AI to recursive reasoning AI. To put this simply, think about that old TV show, Whose Line Is It Anyway? You remember where they would try to make a sentence. Each person would say a word and you would have to follow that person's word to complete the sentence. Of course, chaos ensues and it doesn't really make sense at the end. That's the old linear generative model of AI, like ChatGPT 4.0. It would create the answer based on the words that came before it. New models like O1, DeepSeek R1, and the forthcoming O3 are reasoning models. That means it can look at a bunch of different options, choose the best answer, and then provide that. This is basically the ability to try words in a crossword puzzle, erase them, and then put in the right answer. What happened this weekend is that OpenAI combined these new reasoning models with actual use cases. They created what I would call a narrow agent. AI agents is when you can give an AI a goal and it'll go do it. OpenAI demoed Deep Research, which puts an actual use case on top of these reasoning models. Now, Deep Research allows you to do exactly what it says, research instead of just search. With Deep Research, you can say something like create a competitive analysis in the AI space, and it'll go out, find a bunch of different information from different websites, ask questions, actually find answers to its own questions, and bring those back into a nice report. Anything you might ask McKinsey to do, you can now ask reasoning models to do. So there's this new divergence between AI agents and AI assistants. Agents are reasoning, able to come up with different answers. Assistants are able to give specific answers on your information. Now there's use cases for both. If you are doing an FAQ page, if you're trying to ask questions about health insurance for your employees, if you're trying to give specific answers, you're gonna still want that assistant that looks at the knowledge and gives answers based on it. If you're doing more strategic work, you're trying to look at data, you're trying to maybe create a competitive analysis, you're gonna want an agent that can go out and find its own information and bring it back. Now, reasoning agents, these recursive models are, are pretty new and we're seeing a lot of development. So look for a, a lot of leaps forward in the coming days and weeks. Here at CHIP, we're really excited to offer these reasoning agents on our team plan coming soon. So make sure you sign up so you get first access to those so you can not only create assistance, but also agents that'll go out and solve problems for you.